There are at least three different types of validation. Design validation, process validation, and validation of computer software. Design validation shall ensure that devices conform to defined user needs and intended uses. For example, if you design a software that you claim will help elderly patients monitor their blood pressure, you would be doing some user tests with representative users to see that they, for example, understand how to use the software. Design validation is often done in real or simulated environment. Please note that if the test involves real human subjects, that are patients, the design validation may qualify as a clinical investigation, which is a chapter on its own. Process validation is about validating any processes for production where the resulting output cannot be or is not verified. Process validation shall demonstrate the ability of these processes to achieve planned results consistently. When talking about software as a medical device, process validation of production process is typically not applicable to SAMD. However, ISO 13485 also mentions service provision, which is getting close to SAMD when talking about deploying software to a production environment. But when working with software-only products, the process validation is likely to be entirely about validation of computer software. Validation of computer software or software validation is about establishing a level of confidence that the software is appropriate for its intended use and that it is trustworthy and reliable. Requirements on software validation are found in both QSR and ISO 13485. And software validation would be required for software tools used to create or operate your software as a medical device. For example, Docker, Kubernetes, cloud environment, and even an electronic QMS, if you have one.